Hey everybody, I got a question on Cora that I'm answering with this video, which is going to be more particular to stocks in general, and not to TSP. So uh, the question was asked: Is there a way to set marked white uh, market-wide stock alerts, such as you get alerted when any stock's 20-day moving average crosses over that 100-day moving average? Okay, I'm going to go over info on how to figure this out. Okay, start. And it's 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 not really a cut and dried process, um, but I'll start with uh, going to the Ameritrade website. Now, this is only applicable if you're a TD Ameritrade um, client. I can't really speak for any other brokers, but I, I'm gonna you're gonna end up over here at the stock screen, or I'm gonna show you how to get to it. If you tap mouse over the research and ideas navigation tab, and then over here, screeners select stocks. Okay, you'll end up with this screen here. Now I'm going to hit create a screen. All right, so just come straight down to technicals because this person wants to know any stocks, regardless of what index or whatever exchange they're on, they want to know the answer. Very first option here, moving average crossovers. Check that box, and then you end up right here. Now, Unfortunately, there are only a limited selections. You only have the 15, 50, 100, and 200 days, simple or exponential moving averages. So what you can do instead, uh, at least to get you prepared, hey, this might be alerting with the 2100 crossover soon, is to select the 15 day here and, uh, and trigger it when it crosses over the 100 day average. This is, uh, the 15 days is a little bit faster moving, so it means more likely within a day or two after the 15-day crosses over, you're going to probably see a 20-day crossover as well. So as you see here, there are 15 matches. I'm going to select this list, and there's my whole list right there. So let's just say I want to look at eat, you know, have uh, set up something for Eat in Advance, then I'm going to go to the Thinkorswim platform from here. CEV is the trigger. Okay, on Thinkorswim on the main panel here, you're going to see this. Uh, I already put up uh, the information on VLO, which is uh, stocked up my wife owns. Um, actually, that I do recommend myself. So I'm going to first come in here by putting CEV in there. All right, CEV has no options. I don't really care about that. Now I'm going to hit study alert. And right here, I already have it set up for simple moving average length equals 20, crosses above simple moving average length equals 100. So it, by default, it had something else in there originally, but I'm going to hit edit. Then you'll see what you're working with. Price on close, yeah, 20 day here. And crosses above and then change this to simple moving average and set the length to 100 there show breakout signals you can do that if you want to and then just hit save and then we'll create an alert okay so now what happens is if cev if cev sees its 20-day cross over the 100 then what it'll do is send a uh, Which way is, yeah, it's, it'll play a sound here on Thinkorswim and also send a text message during U.S. market hours, send a text message after hours, or send a push notification to your mobile device. Now, you know, only need, you know, I might only need push notification if I were to do this, but these are all options here, so you'll get alerted right away if, uh, if one of these crosses over. So I can just add all of these, all these different stocks in here if I wanted to do it and just monitor it every day. If you just monitor this daily for any crossovers and, you know, you can just always set up new alerts and then, you know, or just for whichever ones might particularly interest you, uh, that's basically how you can get it done. All right, uh, that'll answer that question on Cora.